All right, today I'm gonna to get this fun, this pallet that I started putting together over here. Uh, we'll get it bolted down and uh, see eventually if we can get it to run on it. Um, but today I think I'll just get it bolted down, set on that pallet and uh, uh, make sure this is 100% secure and then we'll start assembling everything to get it to run. Um, that's the, the cool part is uh, we'll be able to start it and run it on the pallet. And then my plan is to come back and go through all the wiring, um, get rid of the wires I don't need, use some of the wires. I haven't decided what level I'm doing this project to. I may continue using the steering column and the turn signals and everything in this car, or I may just get it to run right now on a pallet and then uh, we'll just put it away until I'm ready to use it in the hot rod over there. Um, all right. Get this thing lifted up. Okay, I've got a lot of wire in here. <laughs> um, I pretty much have everything ready to hook up. Um, I do need to still uh, hook up the fuel tank wiring, uh, which is a blue connector and another that connector right there. Um, I got everything, the gauges hooked up, kind of mounted here. Got the column. I've got the ignition switch, so we're good with that. Um, just need to hook up the battery here. Uh, and then I have about eight grounds I need to hook up. And then I do need to plug off uh, these uh, power steering hoses, or at least attach them together, so that uh, I don't make a mess everywhere and I don't want to burn up this pump. So I will figure out a connector for those. So I just need to hook this line and that line up. I've got the ho heater hoses and, well, I've got the radiator hose and uh, the overflow hooked up. Um, I also have the oil cooler. The condenser's just sitting there. I'm not too worried about the condenser, but it's it's there. I... Put the mass airflow sensor, hook that back up, and put the air box in just, just so we don't get anything in the motor. But I do need to get a connector to connect both of these heater hoses up, just because I'm going to fill this up with coolant, and I don't want to make a mess. So I could start it now, but I, I, I think I need to make sure all my wires are hooked up properly. I mean, I still have a ground here. And I got the computer to mount, the fuse block, and then the spaghetti of wiring that goes in the interior of the vehicle. But um, I, I think I'm going to sort through all these wires and get rid of what I don't need. Um, and then we'll kind of go from there because I, I kind of want to use the gauges and I kind of want to uh, just make it simple. For whatever I do but I do have it on this pallet and uh, it's getting close so subscribe to my YouTube and uh, my next video you'll be seeing this thing start